All right, good morning, folks. It is the AM Icebreaker for Saturday, March 3rd, and we are almost two weeks away, just a little a little over two weeks away from GDC, the Game Developers Conference. In fact, I'll be, I think I'll be traveling down there two weeks from today. Uh, conference starts that Monday. So like I've been saying, if you want a movement screen on site, I'll have my kit with me. I'll be happy to run you through a, run you through a movement screen, get you a little bit of a workup, some information, and then from there we can either program for you or you can take it to a, Take it to somebody you know who can write you uh, some some mobility programs, or you can just I don't know, just just be happy you did it. Uh, I I'll, I'll be happy if you did it because I definitely need more practice screening people. So so either way it's it's, it's so either, either way it works out. Either way it's a benefit, and uh, it's something I'm happy to do for for people, especially uh, you know folks in the in the development community. You know you guys are my people. I love you all, and uh, if, if I can help you out, I'm always happy to. And let's see what else. Leave me a question for the live Q and A tomorrow, which is going to happen. I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm gonna plan my Sunday a little bit better, so I actually have time to do it. And we'll be talking about dry fasting, intermittent fasting. I'm actually on a dry, another dry fast this weekend, just to just to see if I, like how it works. If if it you know if if, if it feels different now that I'm kind of mentally prepared for it, if nothing else. So we'll definitely be talking about that. And I have I have a couple questions already, but um, you know I've got room for more. So feel free to leave me one. And uh, let's see, yeah, there'll be, a, there'll be a Twitch stream sometime this weekend, for real this time, I promise. Um, I don't know if it's going to be the full, like I said, I mentioned I had a kind of a plan for how I wanted to do that. Um, and I'm actually really excited about it. I just, I need to, I need to get some, some more things in place, which I'm going to try to do today. And if that happens, it happens, and we'll do the full one. If not, I'll just probably just play some Diablo and rant for a bit. But uh, yeah, the link to that will be around, so... And like I said, you know, I, I know I've been talking about that a lot, and it's not really fitness related, but it... But I think I sort of alluded to kind of the whole, you know, why 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 I wanted to do that. And I just want to talk a little bit more about that. Um, it's it's funny. I was, I was thinking originally I kind of want to talk a little bit about what JVP calls the prostitute archetype, but I don't know if that's completely. I don't I don't know how much I agree with 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 that notion. I mean, it's it's you know I'll I'll link I'll link to a video that where he talks about it a little bit. But I think what I like more is this idea. Um, a uh, friend and mentor of mine, uh, Cliff Harsky, had a had a great. Uh, a great thing he said he says don't do what you love do what you don't hate and i really like that idea you know i think i think nowadays you know especially in you know small business space or whatever i life space we're inundated with um i'm gonna call it propaganda for lack of anything for, for lack of a better term because that's really what it is this idea that you know yeah just just do what you love follow your passion you know just 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 do whatever just, just do whatever and, and and if you're good at it and you enjoy it you know you'll be fine you know i mean what's, what's one of the memes we see all the time you know studies show that that you know standing up you know stand up at your desk and walking out or something like i, I, I totally butchered it but you, you guys know you've seen it you know what i'm talking about and this idea that ah, you just quit everything and just and i i don't know i mean the more i talk to people who have been very successful in their business pursuits and and then had that carry over to their life i I'm seeing there's a pattern, and that pattern is, it's not so much that people, you know, this idea that, um, well, if you have a plan B, you know, you're, you're screwed. I mean, that's another one that just bugs me. It's like, no, no, you just have, like, yeah, you just just go all in. You just forget it. You know, take 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 the big risk, and you'll be fine. It's like, well, mm, I don't I don't know if that's true. I mean, I the more I think about it, the more I'm glad that I'm trying to, <clears throat> that as I'm, you know, me building up my fitness business, I'm doing it while I have another job that pays really well. And I've talked about this, and I've, I've talked about the fact that I'm glad that, it, that I'm able to go do continuing education, and I'm able to pay for things like this, you know, the amazing mentorship I'm doing with, uh, with Sarah Jameson, or, you know, the fact that, you know, I don't have to... I don't have to go all in right now. I don't. I don't have to be stressed to death. And I know there's. And again, that's another thing. You know, uh, you're not going to succeed until you want success so bad that that you know you that that you, know, you want to you want to succeed as much as you want to, as bad as you want to breathe. You know, and, and I'm not I'm not throwing shade on that. Like I, mo you know, motivation, inspiration is great, but planning and strategy is okay too. So you know, I, I know there's a bunch of other folks out there who are. Who I've, who I've talked to, they were trying to kind of get things off the ground, get things started, and and even those folks, you know, the more I talk to them, it's like, you know, I, I realize they're taking the same path, you know, they're saving up money, they're saving up their resources, they're, you know, they'll, 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 they'll strike when the, when the army is gathered, and, and personally, I think there's nothing wrong with that, I, I, I think you're, I don't think you're any more or less of a, of a success story, or, or whatever you want to call it, or, you know, a proper, proper small businessman, entrepreneur, there's another word I hate, 
because you didn't, you know, because you chose to take a slightly more measured and better planned path. So, yeah, that's what I got. You know, I, I mean, ultimately, do you, but like I said, there's nothing wrong with planning and strategy and tactics. There's nothing wrong with thinking things through. There's nothing wrong with breaking it down and, and seeing, seeing what, uh, you, know, you know, seeing what your options are. But uh, obviously, don't get stuck there, and maybe we'll talk about that tomorrow, the whole paralysis analysis thing. But uh, yeah, that's what I got for today. Um, so, yeah, it's been fun. Thanks. Cheers.